bright. I should turn that light off. I was supposed to wake up exactly at 5, but I ended up just laying in bed for 30 minutes. But I'm up super early today because I'm going to the chiropractor as soon as they open because it gets a little busy. We are doing a monthly reset today, so I have a lot to do on my agenda. I'm so excited for a new month. I feel like October just like dragging, like it took forever for some reason. That's just how I feel though. But let me turn this light off. I'm going to sit here, drink some coffee. I'm going to write my to-do list out and just plan out the whole day. On today's agenda... I'm going to go to the chiropractor at 7.30, I believe it opens. I have to run to a few stores. I also want to go to a bookstore to get a new read. I want to read a fiction, a Christian fiction book this month. Maybe one from Francine River. I had seen a few that people were talking about. And then after that, I do want to look at Christmas decor. <laughs> My husband's behind and he... He doesn't like doing that. But I do want to look at Christmas stuff. Who doesn't want to look at Christmas decor? Guys, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Instagram is driving me nuts with all the Christmas videos. And then I called my mom yesterday and she showed me. Actually, I could show you guys. She showed me a video. She showed me how she's decorating for Christmas. She's not finished yet, but it looks so cute. And guys, I get that from my mom because growing up, she would decorate the entire house. I'm telling you, she would even decorate the bathroom with Christmas stuff. Like, she's one of those people. And you guys already know, if you guys have been watching me for a while, you guys know that I love to decorate. And one of my favorite holidays is Christmas. So yeah, guys. That's just what I'm used to. I grew up with a humongous tree with a bunch of ornaments. I'm telling you, my mom, wow, she has so many ornaments. But yeah, Lord willing, I'm able to vlog and show you guys my mom's house. All right, so yeah, I definitely want to go look at Christmas stuff um, just to see what they have, just to browse a little bit. It's still early. I still have like a whole month to still decorate and all that. I still have a decor from last year and like the year before that I always keep. I just have like my little collection, but I did get rid of some stuff because it doesn't really match the theme that I'm going for. After that, I'm going to do groceries. I'm going to write down the meal prep and all of the stuff that I have to get. And then when I do get back, I'm just going to clean up a little bit, restock my fridge, um, maybe do some laundry. And then I want to sit down with you guys, write down my goals, my intentions for the month, talk about my challenge. And then I also want to book a class for tomorrow. I'm either going to do, I actually don't know yet if I'm going to do a HIIT workout or if I'm going to do something, um, something else. I'm not sure. I tried to schedule a kickboxing class, but it was canceled. So I was a little upset about that. Because I wanted to make a short video, but yeah, they canceled. Once I got to the studio, it was canceled. I had to call, and the guy told me then. I was so irritated, but it's okay. We'll try again. It's pretty much on the agenda today. I want to make sure that my camera is fully charged before I leave this house. Yeah, guys, I'm going to sit here, drink a little bit of my coffee. I'm going to watch a sermon. I watch AP Creek Christian Fellowship. I'll try to always leave a link down below because I do like to share my stuff. I have an online pastor and then I have a church that I go to here in Texas. And then I just watch a bunch of other stuff, honestly, guys. Like, I just love taking notes. Of course, I always make sure that they're preaching the true doctrine and the the true gospel. But I love to, um, I just love watching people. Oh, another thing. It is super chilly this morning for some reason. I went to go take my dog outside, and it is so cold. Let me check the weather, which I'm loving because I'm ready for, I'm ready for this heat to go away. It hasn't been super hot, I will say, but I am so over Texas heat. I really am. Show the weather. It literally says nothing. 
Guys, it is so cold right now in Texas. Like, I don't even understand. I didn't think it was going to be cold today. It's 51. I know for some people that's not cold, but it's freezing over here, okay? It is freezing. And it's going to be in the 50s all day. Oh, baby. This is my kind of day. Freezing. See, I had to change to this gown. They normally always have me change it to this so they can massage my back. Take a deep breath. Let it all out. Nice. Girls be vlogging and like getting everything. It's locked. It's freezing. Getting this book, Bridge to Haven by Francine Rivers. Guys, this is one of my favorite authors. My favorite book of all time is Redeeming Love, and she made that into a movie, which is one of the greatest movies ever. It shows, it illustrates God's love for us and how forgiving and merciful He is, and I love it so much. Oh, I love that movie. stopped and got myself a smoothie this is the pure recharge um this is the strawberry mango flavor i had asked the guy look at the straw that he gave me look at this straw. <laughs> look 
at the straw that this man gave me. Anyways, I'm gonna put these groceries away. Um, but I had asked him what drink was like really hydrating. Cause I was so thirsty, but I wanted something like sweet at the same time. So I just needed something super hydrating. But yeah, I just got back. I'm gonna put all the groceries away. I'm gonna show you guys what I got first. I got beef stew for later. I got some burgers, chicken, turkey, ground turkey, ground chicken. I got lettuce, so this is for lettuce wraps. I got soy sauce, cause I finished the other one. Beef broth, creamer. Um, I finished my garlic, so I needed some garlic. I got eggs for the morning. Greek yogurt for the morning and then cheese and just some peppers. I'm gonna give you a mini haul of what I got from Hobby Lobby. I'll probably decorate like mid-November towards like the end of november found these really pretty ones i don't think that they had these last year i didn't see them at least but um you could just set them on the counter which i really love i think i'm gonna use this for my dining table just really simple and cute because my house is more of modern and it has like vintage touch to it a little bit i don't know my house is like a little it's more modern, if anything, but I think this matches really well with my theme and goes with everything. Before, I used to do a really colorful Christmas, but I'm growing up, guys. It's changing. I got a smaller one. This one I got for the coffee station. I love to decorate my coffee station. I got really cute stuff. So I might go back and get another one of these just because I'm going to decorate my ottoman a little bit and oh it's so bright looks like this i pretty much got a bunch of trees now that i'm looking at it but anyway that's the whole point i got one of these so it's coming out really white on camera but let me turn up let me turn on the brightness it looks like a wood stain on it yeah this is how it looks i got two of them because i'm gonna use these for my entry table I'm just gonna put them together like that i got this for the kitchen um i'm not really too sure i'm not sure what i'm gonna put on it yet but i thought it was super cute and then i just got two ornaments because i threw out the tree that we had the first year that we came to texas um so i want to get a really small tree this year and just put it maybe on my entry table or i'm not really too sure where i'm gonna put it but I want to get a really small one. And I showed you guys in the clip which one I want. It's in Hobby Lobby. It already has snow on it. Um, but yeah, I just got these two ornaments. Like, how cute is that? Oh, I'm so in love with these. I'm going to have these in my garage until I start decorating. recipe but i'm just going to show you guys the ingredients i have beef broth 
I have olives, I have sofrito, I have carrots, celery, I have potatoes, and then right now I'm cleaning the beef. So I just have it in vinegar and water. If you guys do want to make it, you guys can always comment down below and I'll definitely go in detail on uh, the seasonings and all of that. I already started cooking dinner. I have to let it cook for a little. So while that's cooking, I'm going to go over my goals this month, my content, my budget for this month. I was supposed to stop by the bank, but I actually didn't get to. So I'll probably do that tomorrow. Um, so my first goal this month is to be consistent with my challenge that I'm putting together, which is called the Healthy Habits Challenge. And honestly, that's my main priority for the next two months. I'm also going to finish my website for my business. I want to upload a few more products that I have. I also want to start a fellowship chat. I already have the title for it which I'm doing this chat also through the Genevia app, just like my Healthy Habits Challenge. Um, I'm also starting a book club, I forgot. I have to finish that, I haven't, I haven't came up with a name yet. I'm gonna write my intentions for this month. Honestly guys, my intentions for this month is to really get close into fellowshipping with other believers. I feel like sometimes I could really be distant but i don't want to do that i want to i just want to be in fellowship be in a community and really to just be consistent with all of my goals i want to write down my monthly content i feel like everything's really simple this month just because i'm having my challenge and that's really my main goal this month um Plus, I'm going to be traveling this month as well, so I really have like a lot on my plate. And I'm just trying to take one day at a time to really focus on the things that are really important. It being the holidays this month and then the next month coming up is like so much crammed in one. But guys, we are going to be consistent. I'm going to give my all to this challenge. I definitely want to film a video talking about getting over laziness and how I'm actually overcoming that. It's going to be a chit chat video, of course. Um, I just want to make sure I write everything down and be very intentional with what I put out. And I want to go into detail exactly what has been helping me and how I'm sticking to it. I'm probably going to do a productive day in my life. And then I also might be putting out um, a weekly vlog just showing my healthy habits and how I'm sticking to them just to show you guys my progress. And then I'm probably going to do a travel vlog as well since I am traveling. I'm really excited for this month. I'm just have a tiny bit of that. My beef stew. It's already done. Normally I'll cook it for longer, but my husband likes his steak a little chewy. I don't know. Not chewy, but. but yeah, this is how it looks. It's delicious. 